Hey, what's going on guys? It's Elias the Tech here and welcome back to another video. And this time you can actually see my face while I talk and as well as me going to go over a new thing that just pushed out by Eon Hub app. Cast Dev is the owner of Eon Hub app and I am the co-owner as you can see by this sweatshirt right here. And he just made a new UI update and he just pushed it right now. And as of this video publishing it will be tomorrow which is Monday with my HomePod mini video. Alright guys, so as you can see this new update is fantastic. I can't believe that he did this and very impressed by the developers of this app as well. Um, I am pretty impressed by Lewis as you can see and he made mostly the entire UI core. I think about half of it to more than that and then including caps and he actually coded the whole thing by himself uh, without any help. Alright guys, so let's just switch over to the app right now. Alright guys, as we switched over, uh, so I'm just going to show you everything that is brand new and then in another video I'm going to show you how to download everything uh, with the new VIP. It's just Eon Hub VIP 1 and then Eon Hub VIP 3 and you just click a button as of right now but I will definitely go over that once uh, we do in the next video. Alright guys, so we're gonna look at the hacked games first and then we're gonna go to community apps, tweaked apps, and jailbreak apps and let's get right into it. Alright, so as you just click it, you could scroll down. Uh, there is some new games I've noticed in the past few weeks that have been uh, updated by Cast. and the number one app for hacked games right now is iPogo which is a very great app. I very recommend it to everyone that would like to use it. And then we have Among Us, Geometry Dash, BitLife, 8-Ball Pool, Planex Clash, uh, Granny, Play Deads Inside, and just texture packs for Geometry Dash. Next one is Community Apps. And then, so this is Secured Chat, uh, Delta is an emulator, Skins for Delta is a Themes, Lightning Sign is another app signer, but this is actually uh, an app that was on the App Store in the past couple of months and then recently just got taken off again. Uh, Magic Sin is another app signer, App Installer is a tool. Uh, what you can do is you can just grab the IPA format and then just throw it in there and do it from there. Um, and then another one is iBlur, which was created by Cast Dev himself. And then Theos Tips is a Theos guide on how to make a jailbreak tweak. Next one up is Tweaked Apps. Alright, so we got Syracuse 5 Pro right here. We got YouTube No Ads, Paintly Premium. Uh, we got Documents 5 Plus Premium, Messenger Shark Modded. Um, never tried this one, but I'm just assuming uh, like the color is different on it and then just certain things are upgraded a little bit. Uh, we got Spotify, all mods, and then we got T Tinder Plus Plus, uh, which is an auto liker. And then we got Tumblr modded, Visco modded, Photoshop Premium, Spotify Blue, and Skullify Plus Plus. Next one we have is Jailbreak Apps. Alright, so we got Uncover, that goes from 11.0 to 13.5. We got Odyssey, which is another Jailbreak created by Coolstar. Uncover was created by Pwn20 Own uh, a couple of years ago, and then has still been going since, uh, really ranked up in the league. Alright, next we got Flux 6, which is another Jailbreak. We got Ruleless Jailbreak. Four, which is created by Brandon Plank himself. Uh, we got 12 Jailbreak. I've never used this one. Uh, as well as we have Goblin Jailbreak, which is 10.3.x and above to, uh, I believe, 11.0. And then we got Helix Patch, which is 10.0 to 10.3.3. Alright guys, let's just go right into the info. And right here is VIP1 and VIP3. If you click those, uh, as long as your UDID was set to the VIP1, you don't actually have to type in server 1, 2, or 3 anymore as we used to do that in the past. Um, here is the owner, Cast Dev, right here. We can check out his Twitter. And this is Cast Dev's Twitter. And he is very successful on his follower account, on his tweaks, and his development is impressive. Up next is Lewis. And I've just met him recently. Uh, I've actually messaged him a few times with the owner of Ignition, and he's a part of their team as well. As of right now, Lewis does not have a Twitter. It was not working as I clicked the link. Um, I can make sure and check that out and see if there's something wrong with it. Otherwise, he just got suspended or banned. Next up is me, as you can see right there in the corner. Um, that is definitely me, 100%. <laughs> up next is David. He's the owner and manager of Eon Hub, and his Twitter is right here. It's another. And then, so, David has been along with Ignition for a long time. I'd say probably since day one. And he is their accountant, and he is our accountant for Eon Hub as well. 
He is an oppressive person. I would definitely check him out and follow him and see what he has to say about his tweets and anything that is related to Ignition or Yana. Up next is Fitu Um, uh, which is Hector Ruiz. And Hector actually, um, I actually didn't know this his first name. Um, I can't remember what I knew him by, but his original name. But I, I've known him probably for at least half a year now or longer. We've been messaging once in a while. He's giving me tips on YouTube, any uh, like other sort of advice. Um, here's his Twitter right here. Uh, and he has actually a YouTuber as well. And his videos are impressive. He unfortunately got banned a little while ago on YouTube. Not sure why. And I now I actually just realized his name was Boom Hacks by Boom Themes and it is Gumroad.com. Not sure what that is. But uh, I definitely check him out and uh, just check out see what he has to say and his stock market ideas too. Alright guys, I hope you liked this video today. Make sure you guys hit the like button and subscribe down below and tell me what you guys thought of this video. I'm trying to make my videos more professional as you can see. Um, I do plan on making different kind of videos in the future. I just need some ideas and the ideas will come to me soon. I'll see you guys next time. See you guys.